Now we are going to see a new chapter decimals. So before we are going to see decimals, first we must know about decimal fraction because we already seen in the last class fraction. So first we have to see decimal fraction, then we are going to see decimals. Now let's start the class. See, this is a what? This is a, a box. This is how many box? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this box, how many boxes shaded? That is mean that means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 boxes are shaded. So total box, how many? It is 10. So total patch is 10. And how many boxes are shaded? 6 boxes are shaded. So 6 parts out of 10 are colored. And shaded parts, shaded regions written as 6 by 10 or 6 out of 10. So both are decimal fractions. Okay, I'll repeat once again. So this is the uh, what? This is the box I've written. Sorry, I've drawn. Um, how many boxes? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So totally I've drawn 10 boxes. Only 6 boxes I've shaded in red color. So 6 parts out of 10 are colored. Shaded parts are regions written as 6 by 10 or 6 out of 10. Okay, this is the decimal fraction example. And one more example I'm going to say. This is the example 1 and this is a Example 1 and this is example 2. So I have drawn how many circles? 10 circles. From this 10 circles I shared only 5 parts. That is what I have written. If 5 circles are shaded and written as 5 by 10 and 5 parts out of 10 are colored in black. I will repeat once again. I have drawn how many uh, circles? 10 circles from this 10 circle I shaded or I colored only how many circles 5 circles that is what I have written if 5 circles are shaded and written as 5 by 10 and 5 parts out of 5 by 10 we can say 5 parts out of 10 are colored in black the answer is 5 by 10 this is a decimal fraction okay this is an example of decimal fraction.